Three A teams hit the court this afternoon, and as the players fight for a title, they're not alone. Here to tell us about all those students supporting their teams is our own Roger Riley. He joins us live from Wells Fargo Arena with more. Hi, Roger. Hi, Janae. You know, there's a lot of excitement here at the well uh, this week. Uh, the games are exciting, but there's also a stage of sorts uh, for the band, for the school paper photographer, and the dance team. Today, I spoke with the team from Eagle Grove. We get really excited each year that we get invited back to dance at the state tournament because it's a big opportunity and we're really grateful for it. I'm in track, basketball, volleyball, and most of us are all in all different sports. We all cheer. Oh yes, I've been dancing since I was little and most of us have and some of us haven't even danced since we were little. Now the stars were invited here to Wells Fargo Arena. They performed the Elton John song, Don't Go Breaking My Heart. Now this team works hard at their practice, working on five or six songs during a practice. Now they enjoy performing on the big stage here at Wells Fargo Arena. I like the environment. I like, it's just, it's just fun. You can be creative. You can, I mean, you can scream in the middle of a routine and have fun with it. And it's just such a really good like team, I feel like. Uh, right now we are getting ready for our drill team night. So we showcase all of our dances that we have done throughout the year. Now there are 16 members on the Golden Stars team and uh, here at the well that gets involved with the fans and coming up at five o'clock, something you might not think about. The student, uh, uh, the student newspaper yearbook, they have the photographer. We'll introduce you to a, a Dowling photographer. He's six, eight, he's six foot eight tall, just an interesting guy. And he's covering this game for his school. Interesting guy, yeah, tall guy as well. Yep. <laughs> that he gets a yep, lot of extra looks. Okay, mm -hmm. great story. Thanks, Roger.